Oh yeah. What your room says about you. Messy room. You're most likely depressed or you're just lazy. Maybe both. Clean room. You're either an extremely organized person or you got the random urge at 3 a.m. to clean your room and fix your life. Room with clothes everywhere. You're every teen girl, and you probably don't even use half the clothes you have. Room covered in posters. You got obsessed with something and decided to get every poster possible of it. Eventually you're gonna miss your bare walls, trust me. Room full of plushies. You spend all your money on Hello Kitty, anime plushies, and Squishmallows. Room with gaming setup. You're either a YouTuber, Twitch streamer, or you're just obsessed with gaming and now are broke because that's all you spend your money on. Room with toys everywhere. You're a spoiled little kid who's broken half of your toys and makes your parents clean for you. Not messy, but not clean. You're most people. Perfectly balanced as all things should be. Super cluttered. You think cleaning your room will fix it, but really you just have too much stuff. Might want to check out Goodwill donations. Room you share with a sibling. You dream of the day that you have your own room. Room you share with a roommate. You're either the responsible clean roommate or the obnoxious messy roommate. Room with thin walls. You have to go outside or in your car if you're trying to have any personal conversations on the phone. Everything can be heard. Room with painted walls. You didn't want to have a boring white wall, but now the color gives you a headache. Room that's huge. You either live by yourself or you're an only child. Room that's tiny. You have siblings. Room with holes in the wall. You most likely have some anger issues, so maybe you should talk to someone. Room with food everywhere. You waste all your money on DoorDash and are too lazy to throw away your old food. Disgusting, but relatable. Room with lots of pets. Your bed, clothes, hair, shoes, carpet, pretty much everything have fur on it. But you love your fur, baby, so it's worth it. Room with air conditioning. How does it feel to be privileged, hmm? I know, right? It's pretty nice. Room without air conditioning. God bless you during the summer, cause sheesh, that's gotta suck. Room with a secret passage. You think you're in a fairy tale or dystopian movie. Room with a distinct style. Either it looks really good or really off. Room full of IKEA furniture. I'm guessing it took you centuries to assemble all of that. Room with anime merch everywhere. You already have so much, yet you keep buying more, you weeaboo. Room with a color theme. Your room looks very aesthetically pleasing. Only problem is, what if you want to change the color? Room that's actually a closet. You're Harry Potter. Room that's cursed. Get out, get out, get out! Somebody was murdered there a hundred years ago! Room with workout gear. You do calisthenics and are too shy to train at the gym. Room full of plants. You want your room to look like it's from a Studio Ghibli movie. Maybe it would if half of them weren't dying. Room with a black light. You wanted your room to look like a mix of glow-in-the-dark mini golf and a club. Super boring room. Everyone calls your room boring and basic, but to you it's perfect. They just don't get what minimalism is. Room with art everywhere. All this art and no one to share it with. Typical Gen Z artist. Room with trash everywhere. When your friends visit, you tell them, feel free to sit anywhere. There's just not anywhere to sit. Room filled with Polaroid pictures. You think you're so quirky and trendy, but you're really like every other high school girl. Room with no windows. You either feel safe or extremely claustrophobic. Room with rats. Um, yeah, I don't know about you to be honest. Room with a big TV. All you do is eat, sleep, Netflix, repeat. Room with no furniture. You just moved in and you're happy to have your own space, even if it's a little too much space. Room with stained carpet. You have a lot of little siblings that like to hang out in your room and always spill their drinks, or you're just clumsy yourself. Room with no door. If a zombie apocalypse happens, you're dead. Okay, everybody, I hope you enjoyed the video. Comment down below what kind of room you have. Of course, everything is a joke. It's a meme. I'm just trolling. I'm sorry if I hurt your feelings. Thank you so much for watching. As always, my name's Evie Perry, and I'll see you in the next video.